What is going on, Nitro Sites? It is your boy, the Nitro General, here, back at it again for episode 96 of our Pokemon Showdown series. And that means if everything goes right, guys, the episode 100 will be, uh, like, in the end of next week, early the week after. Episode 100. I had 100 episodes of Pokemon Showdown. That's absolutely insane so if you guys want to get caught up on the rest of the 95 episodes you can head over to the playlist tab or you guys can just watch till the end of the video and click on the, the playlist tab in the end card so uh yeah if you guys are excited for this make sure you leave a like down below subscribe if you guys are new all that good stuff because we are on our way to 300 subscribers by the end of the year I'm not sure if we can hit it, but I really, really want to. I also want to let you guys know that we started a brand new series on the channel a couple days ago, um, <coughs> which was Doom Eternal. So if you guys are excited for that, make sure you, you are subscribed for that too. You know, if you guys want to go check out that first episode um, that went up on Monday, you can because there's another episode going up tomorrow and on Friday. So make sure you guys don't miss that if you want to check that out. But without further ado, guys, I just want to get right into the video. We're going to try to get four battles, but we may get more tagline of the series. But yeah, I'm very, very enjoying this team. Well, I mean, I'm enjoying this team, I should say. I'm not, like, super enjoying... Okay, well... Urshifu and, and Kingdra and Dracovish. All right, I'm telling you guys right now that we are going to win this one. But, um, I am going to lead Powerline and Dragoon here. I can hope that they lead Pelipper and Kingdra. That can be my hope. And then, um, Urshifu, Rapid Strike, and Pelipper. So here's the thing. Um, now they do have Lightning Rod, and that is why, um, what I'm going to do here is I'm actually going to double into probably... I'm gonna go probably Geode here, I think is probably our best bet. Um, and then what I'm gonna do is I'm actually going to dual wing B on the Urshifu. <laughs> well, I did not turn down my... Okay, well, cool. Um, oh man, but he's surging strikes, which is... sucks. But we are going to take out the Urshifu here, so I don't really have to worry about that. Um, I am just gonna go into, uh, Dogecoin here, and <clears throat> what I want to do is probably, I could extreme speed, that's what I think I'm gonna do, I'm gonna extreme speed, and I am going to Dragon Dance up. Well, that sucks. I, that really, really sucks there. That extremely sucks, man. You suck. That is so crazy, insanely stupid. Oh my god. That's crazy. I'm, I'm gonna have to go power line here. That's insanely stupid. And I'm just gonna extreme speed into the Urshifu. And I'm going to Dragon Claw into the Raichu, but this is just, it, it, this is bullcrap, man. Like, uh, I don't know. The Thunder multi-scale is really, and then he gets the Para. He gets the Para, now it takes it down to Sash, which is all right, I guess. But now he's going to go into Dracovish, which actually, I'm really hoping that, I'm going to Extreme Speed into the Raichu here, and I'm actually really hoping that with our 1.5 Speed Boost, that we actually take out the we're actually faster. We are not faster than the Dragonfish. Somehow that has Dragon. Wait, what? I meant to go for Dragon Claw. Well, I don't know how that worked. I must have misclicked, which really ends up screwing with us here. Um, I'm actually going to protect, and I'm going to go for a Dragon Claw into the Kingdra. I think that's really what I have to do here is oh um, my god and we make the wrong oh well he doubles actually so maybe we didn't make the wrong play so we do take out the kingdra here um and then what i'm going to do is i'm going to double into boat here and i'm going to dragon claw into the dracovish now please don't have follow me blastoise please don't have follow me blastoise don't have follow me cool we are mean with our water absorb he shell smashes up 
and this allows us to take out the dra No! Are you kidding me? The para! Well, I have to protect here, and I have to Dragon Claw again. You know, this is, this, this really sucks. This really sucks. Water Spout, we sh that should be, oh my god, that's insane, man. That is insane, man. Um. Okay, so now what I really have to do here. I don't think I'm going to be. I have to Ice Beam on, actually wait. Let's Ice Beam on the Dracovish here, and I have the Dragon Claw on the Dracovish as well. I'm pretty sure that we are still slower than that Dracovish, even at plus two speed. That has to be Choice Scarf. It, like, it, it has to be. I really don't physically see any other way for it to be possible that it's not Choice Scarf. So, um... Oh, well, he forfeited. Hey! Well, the thing was is that we are going to come embark with Kartana, and I think we still were, we resisted the Water Spout, so we still might have been able to take out the Blastoise. Actually, I think we would have won that one. Um, that's going to be close uh, since he forfeited. Instead of playing it out like a man at the end of it, there really was no way for us to know that if we were going to win that one, but I think we did do a very good job at bringing that back towards the end. So I'm going to call that one a win. Um, that was actually a, a pretty decent, uh, I forgot about the fake out with the Raichu thing, but, um, alright, well, Kiram, Naganandel, I mean, we just go, probably, man, I, it really does make me want to lead Dragoon, strictly because, of, yeah, we're, we're gonna go power line and we're gonna go Dragoon here, I sh I'm just, I really want them to lead the Kiram because I know I'm faster with Dragonite, which he should be. Uh, no, they don't have anything that really wants to take. So how much are we doing to Metagross with Regilecki? If I, I can't quite remember, not Regice, um, <clears throat> Regilecki against a Metagross. Actually, the thing is, is that Incineroar is going to fake out. <clears throat> So what I'm going to do now is, unfortunately, we don't have anything. Man, our team is so weak to ground, man. Literally every one of our Pokemon on our team, except for Dragoon, is weak to ground. And I didn't even think about that when I was doing this. So I'm probably just going to have to go boat. And I'm going to try Dragon Dance up. Because he's just going to go for Fake Out into Regilecki. Oh, oh into Drag... See, and then this is where it's... <sighs> Why? That... Alright, well, I figured that you were... Alright, well, we're actually just gonna go for a Hydro Pump into the Incineroar, and I'm just gonna go straight up for the Thunderbolt and the Metagross. I don't care. I'm a little irritated that he didn't go for uh, the, the move that he... And he did have Stomping Tantrum. So I literally had it played out perfectly. And it still screwed it up. Well, you know, um, you are 262. I am 227. You're not going to be max speed. If it's max speed, then I swear to God, we're going to go Hydro Pump. And we are going to go for a... Uh, how much? Here in black. Um, with uh, Arcanine against the Kieran Black. Um, we are doing more of the most with close combat. So I have to go for a close combat. He does go into Incineroar, which is nice. Um, we don't KO the Kieran, unfortunately. Kiram has Earth Power. Why does everything on your team have Earth Power? Yeah, alright. Well, GG's. Um, that's a little bit of an annoying that we made the wrong play first time. And then... So, it, he literally had the option to... 
to fake out in Regieleki and Earth Power. And I switch it out, figuring that's what he was going to do. He doesn't. He ends up, and then he does it the next turn, and it really screws it up. I should have just Volt Switched instead of trying to Thunderbolt, because I thought Thunderbolt would KO, but it didn't, so I have not seen an Ice Cube in a while. Um, Alright, well, I like Power Line. I like, I should do it, yeah. I like Power Line, and I do like. I do like Dragoon here, but the thing is, is that they do have two Pokemon that are super effective against, so I'm gonna go Geode actually, because they go Melodic and they go Whimsicott. Now, I'm going to Volt Switch into the Milotic here, and I'm actually gonna double into Boat, um, with the anticipation of Whimsicott going for Tailwind and then them going for like a Hydro Pump into Geode. And I can't let Geode go down here. Um, at least not right now, so, cause the Tailwind is going to possibly make the Melodic faster than the Power Line. I just don't want to take that, uh, lagging tail, so that's fine, I guess. Now we're gonna go for Volt Switch, and we're gonna go for an Ice Beam to the Whimsicott. The fact that that went for Trick, um... Well, thanks for giving me the choice specs. I mean, honestly, you just gave me an insane power boost there. Um, we're gonna go into Dogecoin here. Uh, this is probably gonna go Melodic again, is what I would guess. I can't believe he just gave me the, the choice specs. He literally, okay, forfeit. He literally just gave me the choice specs, which, is insane because that's going to make me KO two of his both like Incineroar and Nine Tails. Like that's yeah, that's crazy. Alright, well, um I don't know if I can count that one as a win. Strictly because it was very, very close. But and it was very early in the game. So but I do wanna say that we might have had that one in the bag. I'm so very salty from that second battle. If you guys can't tell the whole I made the wrong play at the beginning like it was such a simple play and he chose to do the total opposite and I am NOT about to say that he meant to do it right like I know he didn't mean to do it I know that it was just happened to be luck on his part he just he didn't go well he's gonna switch into a different Pokemon so the fake out hits, so I'm gonna go into this one and KO. No, like, no, he didn't. He just saw Dragonite as a bigger threat and went into that. That's what he did. So, um, okay, so let's. This is Trick Room. So I do kind of like. Let's go X and Geode here, I think is our best bet. Um, especially if they lead Necrozma. So the Hitman on top does have fake out. Now, are you gonna go for Tailwind? Huh. Alright, well. Get a bullet punch. So thing is, is that against a Hitmontop, let me just see. Uh, let me see Cartana versus Hitmontop. Hitmontop. Uh, the most Leap Blade is doing the most. So we're just gonna go for Leap Blade, and we're actually just gonna ally switch so that he or figured that he would bullet punch. Huh. Alright, well now I'm gonna go Dogecoin and then I'm still gonna go for a Leap Blade here. Um, anticipating on bullet punch and Encore. Bullet punch. So, I'm not going to worry about that. So now we do have the ability to just extreme speed and Double. We're going to extreme speed and I'm just gonna smart strike just in case something happens. Okay. So we're just gonna smart strike and then we should be able to do quite a bit of damage, if not just take it out. It is focus sash. So um 
Now, if you could go into your Necrozma, okay, four. Well, I don't think he was able to get, I don't know why he tailwinded up at the beginning. Cause it's definitely like, it looks like he has a trick room pour there with Necrozma. Yeah, so really, honestly, Flair, yeah. I don't think he had, a, he had a chance. Everybody's forfeiting today, man. We've had like three forfeits and one loss. All the forfeits though were all in like in our favor. And I understand why people do it, but when it's so early in, in the game, it sucks, man. So thing is here is I, I do want to go Geode and Powerline, I think, maybe not. Actually, let's go X and Powerline. Um, we do have to watch out for the Zero Aura. Okay, so he's gonna go Tapu Fini here. So, thing is now is I am gonna go, I'm just gonna protect here, and I'm gonna go for a Thunderbolt into the Incineroar. Because there he goes into his Zero Aura, but guess what? I saw that coming a million miles away, and you're not going to, you're not gonna do that. Like, I, I saw that coming. So now, we are faster. So if I just go for, I mean, let me just see something here. Kartana against Incineroar. Incineroar. Um, actually, let's switch out into Dragoon here and Thunderbolt again into Incineroar. Um, because if he goes for a fighting type move or something, so we get a Thunderbolt off into Rillaboom, which is kind of nice. Ooh. Man, he's not making some good plays here. So now we just straight up go for a... Do I just go for a dual wing beat or do I try to set up with Dragon Dance? I'm just gonna go for a dual wing beat, I think is our best bet here. And then I'm gonna go Dogecoin to take the Grassy Glide. Um, plus we get a Intimidate off, which is nice. He is gonna go for a knockoff. We knocks off our heavy duty boots, which is fine. So we go that, and then he is going to be taken out by the wing beat, which is perfectly fine. Um, and he's going to go into Mew, which really could have anything here. And then makes me really want to just Dragon Dance out. But if that Mew has like Ice Beam or something like that, I'm going to go Boat, I think. And then I'm just going to go for a Flare Blitz into the Zero Aura. Aw, oh, man! All right, well, we go Lapras here. And he is gonna, just gonna go for Stealth Rocks, okay. So, now what I do wanna do here is probably Hydro Pump. And I am just gonna go for a Flood Blitz into the Mew. Uh, Dogecoin really isn't that useful here. And I need to be able to get another Pokemon in. So, we get a Flare Blitz off into the Urshifu, which is actually nice, because that's a decent amount. And he is just gonna Calm Mind, which isn't great. We get a Hydro Pump off in the Urshifu as well. Um, I am just gonna do that same thing. We're gonna go for a Hydro Pump, and we're gonna go for a Flare Blitz. Into the Urshifu. Uh, luckily, we know we're faster than Tapu Fini. I don't think we're faster than we're not faster than Urshifu, so I can hope he just goes for a Surging Strikes into Dogecoin, and then we take out Urshifu, and we, and <clears throat> we nullify a huge threat. So he does go for a U-turn, so nobody on their team wants to take that. Oh my god, your Mew is dead. Your Mew is so dead. Okay, what I need you to do, Boat, is I need you to hit this Hydro Pump. I need you to hit this Hydro Pump. Okay, it takes it down to 6%. Um, we are going to go power line here and we are just going to go for, um, I should go for a hydro pump into the top of Fini. Actually, let's go, let's try to do a pro play here. We're going to try to go for a hydro pump into Mew and I'm going to go for a thunderbolt into top of Fini. Please switch out your Mew. Please switch out your Mew. Please call my bluff from what I did at the beginning. Oh, he had fake out. I didn't expect fake out. Um, 
Okay, well, your Mew's gone. Uh, I'm assuming you go Zera Aura. Okay. Which leaves me to just Hydro Pump into Zera Aura and double into. Because you're just going to go for a fake out. So let's just go Geode, I think, probably. Because you're just going to go for a fake out. And. Ooh. Oh ho ho, snar- Oh, you didn't even go for a fake out. I was like very sure you were going to go for a fake out here. Alright, well now I'm going to go for a protect and... Actually, wait. Let's go for a hydro pump and an ally switch here. So, Plasma Fist into Geode, yup, saw that coming, and then how much are we doing with Hydro Pump? Oh, we missed it, missed on Geode, that's perfect, no! Boat! Boat! Come on, Boat, come on, Boat! That sucks, now I could go for another ally switch, I, we're, we're gonna go for another ally switch, I don't care, we're gonna try it, if he calls it, he calls it. Um... God, that Tabu Fini is such a big issue. Um, as long as I can get Reggie Alecki back in. Okay, yeah, well, he called it. Well, he did not call it. So now, Boat, you need to hit this. Boat, take... Oh, man, that did not do anything. All right, well, let's go Reggie Alecki now. Now, I know what you're going to do, is, so I'm just going to... We're gonna Ice Beam just because, and then... I guess I can Thunderbolt on Tapu Fini. Like, it's just gonna protect, but... Um, and I knew, and I know that's what you're gonna do. Uh, well, oh, well you tanked that boat. If I get the freeze, we don't get the freeze. Um, okay, now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna protect, and I'm gonna go for a Thunderbolt into the Tapu Fini again. Nothing on his team wants to take a Thunderbolt from Reggie Alecki, so whatever is, is, is probably going to... I mean, you have times two special defense. So, <clears throat> I mean, come on. We're Transistor, Max Special Attack, Choice Specs, even with the, the plus two, it still withstands it. Unfortunately, it still withstands it. Um, and we shouldn't have protected there. All right, well, <clears throat> um, I'm going to go into X here. And... You are 295, I am 348. I'm gonna go for the double protect here and I'm gonna go, just gonna go for a Lake Blade just in case he wants to switch out. Um, God, that, that Zero Aura is so, oh God, no, what did I do? What did I do? What did I do? What did I do? He's just gonna go for, oh. Man. Sucks, and we got the double protect, but it doesn't really matter. Now I gotta go for a hydro pump, and I have to just go for a leap blade. This sucks. Oh, wait, did he? Did you just? Oh my god, you just threw this entire battle because you decided that you wanted to try to get an intimidate off. You threw your the the entire battle because you got cocky, man. You threw the entire battle because you got cocky. I mean, that's... Oh, you... No, surging... No, yeah! Come on, uh, don't... Yes! Oh, God! Yeah! Whew! Got a little scared there for a, se for a second. He did go into the Pokemon that I needed him to go into. So now, I am just going to go for a Dragon Claw, and we are just going to go for a Leap Blade. I have to be able to... For some, oh god, yes! Come on, Kartana, uh, Urshifu is out here. Dragon Claw, and it takes it out, and we get the win. We get the win, guys. Thank the Lord. Now I'm just gonna jump into one last battle for you guys. I don't totally know. We've had four forfeits. We've had a win, and we've we've, we've had four forfeits that were all in our favor. We've had one perfect win or I, not by perfect like by perfect I just mean like um a win where we they didn't forfeit and then we have had a loss 
So we're gonna try to jump into this last battle. If it could be a win, that would be fantastic. All right, so we got a rain team here, which is kind of along the same lines as what we did last time. So I do kind of, I'm just gonna go power line and dragoon here. Uh, dragoon here. Um, <clears throat> so can you lead Pelipper and uh, be Ghost Bear Scooter? So Bear Scooter in the rain is like 700 and something speed. So the thing is here is I'm just gonna go into boat. And then we're just gonna go for a Dragon Claw in the race That is the, the play here, because if you go for Liquidation, he does. So we get a Dragon Claw off, <clears throat> and he could be Focus Ash, but, and he goes for a Hurricane, which is not really gonna do anything, but he gets the Confusion, which sucks. I can't say how many times I got Hurricane before and only got a Confusion like a couple times, so I'm gonna go Ice Shard, and um, I go for a Dragon Claw, so. And that's okay. And then we just go for an ice shard. Your breath is gone. Um, so that's that's pretty big. So I hurt myself with my confusion. So he goes into the Ludicolo, um, which is all right. So now I'm going to. I don't even know who I want to go to here. I guess I just ice beam on the Pelipper, and we do a wing beat on the Ludicolo. So you have Energy Ball, I didn't even think, why didn't I, and we, okay, so we snapped out of our confusion, Ludicolo goes down, it's another big threat, really the only, the biggest threat here is the Kingdra, and he gets a second confusion? Are you legitimately kidding me right now? So there's the Kingdra, there's the biggest threat here, it really, really, really is, I am going to protect, actually, yeah, we're gonna protect for a little bit more, and then I can try to go for a Dragon Claw, but the thing is, is that... It's, 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 it's just... So the Rain has... He has two Rain Setters on his team, right? So as soon as it goes down, he can just go into Polyturn to get it back up. And... So he goes for a Hurricane. Get a little bit more. So the thing is here is that... We really don't have anything. Because the thing is, is that if it goes down, he can just go into Polito that same turn and get it right back up. So it's not even like waiting for the rain to go down. And his Kingdra is just going to sweep this team. And that's... Uh, I don't even know. I could try going... Um... Well, let's go X. <clears throat> I have an idea here, right? Let me go Ice Beam into the Pelipper, and I just protect here. Thing is, if I get two Pokemon in, right? And, okay, I, I kind of, well, he goes into the wrong slot. Why would you do that? So we got it. We have to go Geode here, and the thing is, is that now what I want to do is I want to ally switch and I want to just leap blade and then just hope. I want to ally switch, leap blade, and then just hope. Hope that he goes for a dragon pulse into X and then it goes into Geode and it doesn't affect it really doesn't affect me. So he's damp rock, so we know that. Um Come on, please do it. Hurricane and then we played. Oh, we outsped somehow. So he goes for. Oh, oh my God, that was Holly Toad. Um, oh God, this is. I have to go Dragoon here and actually wait, wait, wait. Let's protect and try to go for a diamond storm. Oh my god, probably do it has surf. Ooh. Alright, alright. Alright, so this is <coughs> So I have to go power ready lucky here. And now I go Dogecoin and we go for a Thunderbolt on 
the Pelipper, because I'm hoping that he switches out Politoed and think I'm going to go into that. Please, 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 please. No! He goes into the right Pokemon? Since when you go into the right Pokemon? That sucks! Oh, you went to the right, come on, power line. Okay, cool, you did withstand it. So we go into X, and now I think I could go just Leap Blade and Thunderbolt. If we play this right, we can still win. Come on, come on, come on. God, yes, we won. Thank the Lord, we won, man. Oh. I was like, okay, if we play this... I really thought that he wouldn't go... I thought he would switch out his one in full health, right? Because wouldn't it make more sense that I would go into the one with full health? But either way, um, because I played it very close at the end, I don't know what happened with the Kingdra there, but uh, we got it. We got the dub, guys. If you enjoy this episode of Pokemon Showdown and you want to show me some support and you want to show the channel some support, leave a like on the video, subscribe if you guys are new, all that good stuff, guys, but whatever, you know, whatever you want to do at the end of the day, because I, I really enjoy making content, and if you guys enjoy it, then I'm super glad. If you don't, then that's okay, because I just make content. At the end of the day, I just make content because I enjoy making it, right? Obviously, if I was just doing it for the views, I would still be doing it, because we don't get very many views. We have 200 subscribers, and we barely get any views on videos, somehow. But, <clears throat> it is what it is, guys. So, if you guys want to help me hit my end of the year goal of 300 subscribers, Hit that subscribe button, share with your friends. But at the end of the day, guys, like I say at the end of every video, I'm the Nitro General. I really hope you guys enjoyed, and I will see you in the next episode. Nitro General is out. Peace.